Junior. Okay, um, so do this problem. It's a little bit different than our tangent because remember what we're gonna do when we're finding the inverse, the inverse of cosine, sine, and tangent have their special restrictions for us to be able to uh, determine their value. So here I need to find the arc cosine of negative two thirds. Same thing as finding our inverse. Now, to do this, remember, this just says a negative two thirds. If you remember cosine, the when we're talking about the inverse graph of cosine, remember our, uh, our restriction had to be between zero and pi. So if I look at this in negative two thirds, remember negative two thirds is going to tell me um, that uh, it's always going to be your adjacent over your hypotenuse. So therefore I can have two triangles. So I can either have this be negative two and my hypotenuse is always three, or I could be negative two and my hypotenuse is down three. So I can either have a positive or a negative uh, y value pretty much with there. However, when we're thinking about using the inverse, we need to remember that cosine, the inverse is between zero and pi. Therefore, this triangle is not gonna work. You guys see that? You guys see how the restrictions for your inverse helps you determine which triangle to use. So therefore, now I have my hypotenuse is three, my uh, um, adjacent side is negative two, so now I just need to find this y value. So I have three squared equals negative two squared plus b squared. So I get nine equals four plus b squared minus four, not minus four, minus four, five equals b squared, take the root, b equals root five. Then it says I need to find the sine using this. So the sine is going to be your opposite over your uh, hypotenuse or your y over your hypotenuse. So sine is going to be that of five. Make sense? Did? So just find what your inverse is, use your restriction to determine which triangle you're going to use, and or make sure it's within your uh, you know restriction of your inverse uh, inverse, and then just evaluate for your last triple. Okay. Kimberly, you sounded like you looked like